don't know if you can tell, but my shirt is covered in dog hair. <laughs> I have to change my shirt, I don't know, two or three times a day sometimes. And you know, I know being a dog walker, it's probably expected that you get dog hair all over you. Uh, but sometimes, you know, the pet owners are at home and I kind of feel like, I don't know, even if I'm walking around, I should uphold some level of appearance, I guess. Uh, yeah, obviously I had uh, a couple pet visits today, this morning, so I've got a break uh, in between. So I figured I'd come out on a walk. Um, it's Monday, August 22nd. Today marks uh, six years since I started uh, my first weight loss journey, chapter, whatever you want to call it, uh, back in 2016. So six years. Uh, I was really excited. I was really excited for today. I've been looking forward to today. That's why I created the video I did yesterday, ending my challenge, kind of like a day early. So today could be a fresh start. It's a Monday. Things just haven't really been going my way today. Uh, the real, the real problem is I didn't plan. Like I, I, I thought about doing a vlog today, but I did no pre-planning. And I kind of got up this morning and I had a bunch of stuff to do. And I already kind of felt like I was running a little behind. Uh, one of the pet visits I had to do was transportation. So I will sometimes drive dogs to, to daycare and back or for grooming, that kind of thing. So I had to put the dog uh, seat cover on in the back of the car because that wasn't there. Um, so the car uh, was really low on gas and I was worried that I was gonna have to stop for gas maybe pushing me late for the first couple visits I had for the day. So that didn't help. Uh, then I tried to, I tried to vlog in the car and I just, I think I have a camera mount for in the car, but it, again, I didn't pre-plan. So I had no way to mount it. And I had this little uh, gorilla pod so I just kind of set it up on the dashboard, but the camera was like falling over. And like, I just, I just gave up. I was like, I'll just record a video later, which is what I'm doing now. So yeah, I do my, uh, I do my couple pet visits and I was like, you know, let's stop at Panera and get a coffee, right? Coffee cures all wounds. <laughs> I go into Panera, put my order thing in. You know, I have the unlimited Sips Club. So I get a light roast coffee usually. Uh, I'm just not a heavy, like dark coffee drinker. So I go over, it's like self-serve. So I start pouring myself a cup of coffee and I've poured myself quite a few cups of coffee in my lifetime. So I kind of know the consistency of dark versus light coffee and that this was heavy this actually looked like motor oil i was pouring into the cup i even double checked it looked like i said i'm using the light roast coffee container so i was like all right what am i going to do anyway am i going to like take my cup up to the counter and go hey i'm a coffee connoisseur this is not light roast you know probably nothing they could do anyway so I go to put my half and half in. Again, I've made quite a few cups of coffee in my day. I'm pouring a half and half in, and I know how light coffee should get, like a light roast coffee, or even a medium roast, how light of a color it gets when you pour a certain amount of cream or half and half in. This did not lighten up very quickly. So I poured even more in. Put the lid on, head out, I'm driving, wait for it to cool down a little bit. Sure enough, take my first drink, 
it was really dark. It was a really heavy, heavy, heavy coffee. And I've had their dark roast. This was this was heavier than that. I don't know what this is. Anyway, it was a waste. It was a waste. Uh, it was just, uh, yeah, things just weren't going my way this morning. And then, you know, I pictured today being this bright, sunny day, you know, where I'm starting fresh and new and it's overcast and cloudy. Can you see that? There's a little bit of blue sky behind me here, uh, but all I see up here is clouds. It's been it's been raining a little earlier. Anyway, um, yeah, I uh, I did eventually stop for gas, and while I was sitting there getting the gas, I thought about food, and I was like, you know what? I'm really not that hungry. I ate a lot yesterday. I really don't need food. I don't, I don't really, uh, yeah, I don't need it. But I'm thinking about it because of the way the day's going. Yeah, I, I, I went home, I, I poured myself a cup of coffee, just a Keurig, put my half and half in, and then I did make myself uh, toasted bagel with a little bit of crunchy peanut butter on it so not the worst food in the world to be eating not the best either so but you know what I think I needed this day you know coming off the video I made yesterday where I basically was saying there's there's not going to be a good time to lose weight or just get your life in order right you know, move toward happiness and do more of what makes you happy, you know? Um, there's never gonna be a good time. And so, I think I needed today to throw me these curveballs as just the, you know, remember, things aren't always gonna line up. It's not always gonna be, you know, what's it, unicorns and rainbows flying out my butt, you know? So, yeah, I, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna spend some time later today, uh, getting some things in order, just making sure that I don't have obstacles in my way, you know, things that just, um, uh, that just might prevent me from moving forward or, or doing what I want to do. And that doesn't necessarily mean that I'm going to have the motivation and the ambition and everything to do everything I want to do. But removing the obstacles, I feel like, is the first step. And yeah, I think today would have gone a lot, a lot better had I planned a little bit more. So... You know, kind of starting out on a, a down note, I guess. But, you know, I'm keeping that um, optimism. Still, I'm looking for the silver lining. Uh, you know, I'm not counting this day over. <laughs> not, uh, who knows? Who knows what's in store for me later today? So... Yeah, I'm just going to, like I said, do some more planning later, get some things in order, and try to hit tomorrow um, I don't know without as many obstacles in my way. You agree? Okay, thanks. Anyway, uh, that's it for today. I have a bunch of pet visits to do. I have a couple more transportation runs to make. Uh, so it's a busy day. Uh, ah. See you in the next video.